Hey guys, what is up? It's your girl Tiffany. So I am back. I hope you're don't mind. Um, I've just come back to get this video up. I'm putting it up tonight because the next two days I'm going to be really busy getting ready for yet another yard sale. I just have so much stuff. So I've really wanted to do an empties video for quite some time, but I can never remember to keep it. I always just throw it in the trash and it's gone. Um, but um, over the last month or so, I've collected stuff and I've been remembering because I've been su now I'm super proud of myself. So I can show you guys what uh, I have used up. These are all beauty products. Um, I may do food or something later on if you like these kind of videos. So yeah, if you want to see what my empties are, please keep watching. We're going to have three categories. Um, obviously, I'm going to have my opinions. Um, it's either really good, I'm really going to rave about the product. Um, it's not good, and I don't want, don't want to ever use it again, which I don't think I have any products like that. Or it's kind of in the, in the middle. Like, it does, it does its job, and it's okay. So it's like really good, the good, the bad, and the ugly. Okay, so if you're new here, I would totally love if you would hit that sub sub subscribe button and I can't speak. That would make my day. And yes, you would totally make my day. I just got out of the shower and I didn't want to look too plain on this video. So I put some big earrings on for you guys. But anyway, getting into this video. So let's go over the beauty products I have. So technically this first product I'm going to show you, I can get one more use out of. But this is my face wash that I use. Um, yeah, I'm supposed to use it every day. But honestly, I don't wash my face every day, which I know is bad. But this is what I use. I've been using this for years. So this is Clean and Clear Morning Burst Facial Cleanser, oil-free. Um, with bursting bead, wakes you up, rinses clean. With vitamin C and ginseng. It's a Johnson & Johnson. So this is what I use um, sometimes if I don't see this, I pick up, there's an Equate brand that says it compare it to Clean and Clear. So both of those, in my opinion, work the same. Um, like I said, I can still get like one or two more uses out of this. But I just wanted to show y'all what I use as face wash. And yeah, I've just been sticking with this. Um, I have dry skin, just for your information. But yeah, that's what I use. Okay. So this next one is Nivea Oil Infused Lotion Cherry Blossom and Jehovah Oil. So I really love the cherry blossom. love something that smells good. And it's just an overall good lotion. So I would, I would repurchase this. Okay. Okay. And the next, this is a Dollar Tree product. So this is White Rain Moisturizer Conditioner, Coconut, and Hibiscus hibiscus so i really love coconut my husband actually really loves to eat he likes to eat coconuts and he loves the smell of coconuts he really turned me on to coconuts because i never noticed coconuts before but um yeah this smells really good and yes i would repurchase this it does its job and it smells good okay once again this is a dollar tree product this is white rain body wash and it is Lavender Escape. So I do like this product. Um, it's okay. It kind of falls in the category of being okay. I'm not going to... It's not wonderful and it's not horrible. But it does the job. It does what it's supposed to do. Gives, gives you... Cleans your body. <laughs> okay. So next, I have... I, I pretty much consider this for men. Even though it doesn't say for men. Cause it smells like it would go on a man but this is what my husband uses um, for shampoo and conditioner and body wash it's three in one it's arm and hammer um, it's 12 ounces you guys this smells so freaking good oh my gosh it is fresh scent I am telling you I am telling you I, miss, I forget that my husband just puts this on, and I think that he puts cologne, and he's all spraying himself up in the bathroom for me. But no, he's just putting on his Arm & Hammer uh, body wash conditioner. Get this for your man. Get, if you have a man, get this for your man. You're going to be all over your man. This smells really, really good. 
Okay. Okay, another Dollar Tree product. I do get my razors most of the time from Dollar Tree, sometimes from Walmart, but I always look for these when I'm at Dollar Tree, and it's, um, this is the package it came in, um, and they're pink razors, um, comes with five razors, and it's got three blades. Um, these work really well. I don't get, it cuts a lot of hair. I don't get cuts on my legs, and they just really work for me. Okay. And so next, now this is a rather expensive product. I don't know if you can tell. Um, for those of you that, no, you can't really tell, but for those of you that have been watching me a while, that you know that I uh, dyed my hair in the past. I actually haven't been to a hair salon since um, September. I mean, it's almost been 10, what, 10 months? Um, so it's been a while. I'm de definitely in need for a color and um, cut. But anywho, my husband... I was getting red. Well, my husband's a big fan of red, plus I just like red. So I had my hair done red, and he went to Sally's, yes, yeah, Sally's, and got me this. He got a conditioner and um, a shampoo, and this is Quantum Riveting Reds. So the reason I only have the shampoo to show y'all and not the conditioner is because if you're like me, you put loads and loads of conditioner on your hair, and um, so yeah, the conditioner was gone. It lasted a while, though. I'll say these are big containers. This is, I mean, this is one liter. Um, this, they both lasted me six months. So, um, I do think it helped a little bit with uh, um, helping the color stay in my hair. Once my hair is dry, you can still see some red in there. Um, but, yeah, like I said, I think this was like $16 a bottle. But, yeah, if you got red hair, you may be interested in that. It's, I don't think it's sold at Walmart or anything. I think you had to go to Sally's for that, but... He paid $16 for the shampoo and $16 for the conditioner. So. Uh, oh, and I already talked about this, but I got another conditioner. This is coconut, so you can tell we like this a lot. Okay. Now, this is a conditioner also from Dollar Tree. It is called, it is suave, and it is called Waterfall, Waterfall Mist. And this one... Smells really, really good. Really good. Yeah, if something smells good, I'm all for that. Okay. And then, um, I just finished up this Bath and Body Works lotion. It's Hello Beautiful 24-Hour Moisture Body Lotion. And this would have gone a lot further, but Penelope, my daughter, gets into my lotion. And, yeah, it goes pretty fast. But I would recommend this lotion. It's a good scent. I like it. Okay. Okay, so next we have Amazing Grace Lotion. Um, this is it from the brand Philosophy Firming Body Illuminate. So this actually was my mom, and I just um, started using this after she passed away. And uh, this smells amazing, and I even got a compliment from my husband. So if you know my husband at all, you know that he hardly ever gives compliments, but I was wearing this after my shower, and he was like, man, whatever lotion you're, you put on, it smells good. So, I mean, it's a win for the husband. I really like it, and I've got dry skin, 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 I cannot speak. I've got dry skin. It says, conditions and helps maintain moisture level of dry skin, leaves skin feeling velvety, soft, and delicately scented. So, this was eight ounces. So, I definitely would repurchase that again. Or I didn't purchase it, but I would repurchase it. Okay. And last but not least, um, this technically isn't a total empty. It's I mean it's getting it's only got about that much more left. But um, if you saw my last video, or I may pop a picture up here if I can. Um, I have um, my hair's naturally wavy. So if you got really if you got like naturally wavy hair or some curl in your hair. And after your shower, if you want to keep those curls locked in, this is the curl cream I use. It is called Miss Jessie's Pillow Soft Curls. So this is what I used in my hair. I just scrunched it with my hands. I don't use a diffuser or anything. I just scrunch it for about 10 minutes, and then I lightly put it back in a ponytail, and then I take it out, and then it's, it looks good. So Miss Jessie's Pillow Soft Curls. Now, I'm going to say that this is expensive. I, th I know it was over $10 um, at Walmart. And there's actually a cream, 
a curl cream there that works better. I can't for the life of me remember what it is, but it, what the name of the brand is, but it is, it smelled like coconuts and it was green. And I'll say that that one was better than this one. Cause for me, like I'm big on how something smells, especially if it's your hair, you want your hair to smell good. This one smells okay. Like it's okay. But like I said, it did the job of keeping my curls in and I honestly didn't have a lot of frizz or anything like that. So that is sold at Walmart. So, you guys, I guess that completes it. That is my first empties beauty products. I hope you enjoyed it. Let me know if you use any of these products or what you think. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. I hope y'all have a great weekend coming up. And I'm probably going to have my next video Sunday night, and that'll be what's in my purse. What I have in my purse. Yeah. So, thank you so much for watching. Again, I love you, and um, y'all take care. Bye, guys.